Hi guys, my name's Mitz and um, I went to the Google AdWord Planner and um, I actually pressed on the download link and downloaded my research. I'll quickly just show you how I downloaded um, the keywords, it's really easy. So I was in the Google AdWord Planner and um, you can go and see my other video about that, how I got here and all that jazz. Um, so I typed it in and got these keywords which is the one in the Excel sheet but all I did was press download and see how it says I've already generated a file. Um, anyway I can press on that and say save link as or if I haven't generated a file I'll just press download um, you can't press, um, oh actually, let's see if we can say save as, you can. You can save as and choose where you want to save it on your computer. Alright, um, or you can just press download, whatever you like. But if you're using Google Chrome, then the downloads will probably show up in the bottom of your screen or else you can go to the settings menu and immediately on the settings menu in Chrome, I'll just take you there, go right up there, right up in the corner of Chrome, go to downloads and it'll show all the downloads you've done. Okay, so that's how easy it is. Now this was just about one keyword and it was, it was computer tips and what happened is it gave me groups now I'm going to scroll down and you'll see how it's got keywords like computer shop. If I scroll down this document, um, it has all the different keywords coming up. So make a computer, buy a computer, build a computer, uh, etc. Now within those groups, they had other keywords which were here. Okay, so let's just um, start at the top. So to do with a computer shop, there's all these, and these, see how it says computer brands, computers online, computer shops, that was under this group, okay? So let's scroll down. Uh, let's look at Windows Speed, and these are the keywords in that group there, okay? So speed up Windows 7, uh, Windows 7 speed up, speed up Windows XP, speed up, yeah, all that, all to do with Windows speed. Okay, now um, what we can do here is to sort a few things out. So we've got the av average monthly um, traffic here, okay, that's expected for these. Now we also have the competition and we also have this section where it's got the um, suggested um, amount for the pay per click basically, something like that. So let's just say the more, the, the bigger the amount, the better. Okay, so what I wanted to do was just show you how to sort these columns, which is really, really easy. Um, so it depends on your intentions. So just say we're looking for the average monthly traffic and um, we're at, well, let, let's just say we're looking for the low competition which is here. I'm just going to click on this. If I click right here, double click, it'll open up that um, column to fit what's in it because we couldn't see the word competition. Okay, so just so I just want to do this, double click there and you'll see the full column. Now, if I want to select that column and sort it, okay, the whole column, um, I don't want to do it by itself, okay? I need to select the whole entire sheet here. So at this stage, I would just click this little tiny um, option in the corner here, this little triangle there, and it selects the whole sheet. Okay, now I do not want to just sort this column because the this data is attached to all of these other columns, so I need to sort them together. Now in order to sort them, 
So I've selected the whole lot. I need to take note that we want to actually sort column E. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go right up to the top of the screen on the right hand side and I'm going to go to sort and filter and press on it and I don't definitely don't want to do any of these I want to go to custom sort okay and that box is going to turn up okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go sort by okay and it's got it's got the name of the columns here so basically I didn't have to say that it was E okay competition is E now what value we just want to do it as the value because that's what it is it's not colors or fonts or anything and we want to go do we want to know the least competition or the most I say we want to know the least so we'll go smallest to largest so if it was the other just say if you want to um, sort the suggested bid column you would probably go largest to smallest okay so let's press OK okay so it's resorted now let's have a look now firstly it put all the zero competition up the top Okay, there's absolutely no competition on these and also there's not much traffic on them okay so don't get too excited but still this is what we call long tail and stuff so you can go for that if you like now keep going down now we start to get to a little bit of competition okay so let's just say that when we get to point zero five it's like medium or medium competition or something like that uh, let's have a look how far it goes actually it might be a little bit less because let's have a look yep it only goes to one so um, one is down here where it's very very high competition let's have a look down here it only goes to one so this is high competition so yes 0 0.05 would be medium competition um, or 0 0.5 this one here right here that is medium competition okay 0 0.5 got to get my maths right um, anything before this is kind of low especially up this end okay so you can look at um, how fast is my computer um, computer specs online computers not all works for you though you want something that's interesting things to speed up your computer um, improving your computer speed is all there's a few here now you can pick out amongst these that the ones that have got the most traffic but they're also the shortest keywords as well so these ones this is an interesting one that I haven't got on my website computer cable management tips now that is a great idea right there okay unusual um, not much traffic but I dare say that um, yeah that'd be a good one just to pick up some long tail people um, computer slowing down I never thought of that one I always thought of speed up computer slow down computer yeah the computer is slowing down yep alright um, now there's heaps down here that you can have a look at now the reason I'm checking out the lower competition is because it's very hard to get into the other section of course I have I am in there um, like probably in this one how to speed up your computer um, it says there's 10 there that's not much at all but I'm probably in that one um, I'm definitely not in computer shop because if you look up computer shop 
you will get computer shops that are near you okay um, but if you look up um, how to talk to a uh, you know computer salesperson in a computer shop then you might find one of my articles but you definitely won't find an article of mine that just says computer shop okay so um, yeah you can see what I mean about some of the keywords that won't work um, desktop uh, I don't know about that one that um, that particular word is a bit broad for me so I've done words like that before and it's very very touchy because people are looking at not just computer desktops they're looking at a desktop like a real desktop okay so it's a bit of confusion because it doesn't say computer desktop it's not very it's not defined enough for me okay uh, defrag computer looks pretty good now also in this column over here it has a um, dollar ninety six suggested so it's pretty good uh, price on it as well um, so anyway that's how you sort the stuff out and check it out you can also you can sort it by anything you like most traffic so let's go back and select the corner go up to sort and filter press custom and we're going to choose the average monthly searches and go let's just say we want to find out who's got the biggest searches and go like that okay so laptop it's got the highest competition and it's got the highest amount of searches now what if you're looking for this kind of stuff the average monthly searches you should look for something with really low competition now this online computer it's got traffic but what the hell is it you know what, what really does that mean um, I would say it's something to do with online computer course or something like that but yeah no the reason it's low competition is because that's not very clear that keyword about what it's actually meant to be um, okay now as you can see all these ones with a lot of searches do have a fair bit of competition up here okay now this one here's got low competition and it pays okay and it's got traffic so how to speed up the internet so this looks pretty good um, what else have we got so we go down we're looking for the lowest low competition here so like I said this one here is medium okay so that one there was really good to be up that high when I've sorted it like this and um, yeah so now you can see how sorting the columns different ways can give you a different perspective on your keywords as well all right um, I hope that helps you find a couple of really uh, golden keywords for your website all right thanks for watching